Why, hello, hello, people. Uh, this is a quick PSA to make sure that all of you are, are um, uh, understanding of the fact that Nightwave is about to end. <clears throat> like, th they've added more notifications now to make sure that people don't miss it, but there's always people who do. And uh, I'm doing my part to make sure that you don't lose out on stuff. Now, as of some of you ain't doing all as this of this recording, of it's gonna hearts. go up pretty quickly. Uh, Nightwave this season ends in four days. Now, what that means for all of you, uh, maybe new players who don't understand, Nightwave is going through like uh, different seasons and then they're replaced by new ones. <clears throat> and when they do, the reward track is replaced. So we're gonna have like a new intermission season. Uh, where we're gonna get um, new rewards. It's all gonna go back to zero. But what is important to know is that these these credits the uh, that you can use in the cred offerings store, these are bound to this specific season. So, all the credits that you have now, the, the volume two creds, okay? They are not gonna be usable in in uh, volume three or whatever it's gonna be like um, because yeah it's gonna be <laughs> volume three we're gonna get a new type of credit you will not be able to use these credits uh, they will become useless so if you have a bunch of credits stored up what you have to do is you have to spend them you have to spend all of your credits in the next four days so that's why you go to your cred offering store. If you have any Nightwave creds that you haven't spent yet, do spend them. Some things are more priority than others. If you have everything, then you can just go for like some cosmetics, I guess, some cool helmets. If you're a new player, these aura mods are great. In particular, Corrosive Prediction is a great aura mod to help you fight against Grenier. If you don't already own this one, you should definitely get that one. And um, there are also some things that are uh, kind of exclusive here. If you haven't crafted Vauban yet, this is how you get his component parts. You buy the blueprint for Vauban uh, from the market for credits, but then you get his component parts here for Nightwave creds. Other than that, you can get Orokin Catalysts and Orokin Reactors that you can use to double the mod capacity of either a weapon or a Warframe, which is uh, very useful for increasing your overall, you know, power. And if you're in the mood to build Prime Warframes, Prime Warframes will always require uh, this, Nitane Extract. And farming for Nitane Extract in-game is, is one of the worst experiences you can have. It's like, it's, it's terrible. To the point where it's like, I'm gonna say that now, like buying this with, with Nightwave cred, is how you are supposed to get Nitane Extract. You're always gonna need it, well, unless you're like me and you already have all the primes, so you can just stack it up for a rainy day in the future, I guess. But other than that, you're gonna need Nitane Extract, and this is how you get it, by spending your Nightwave cred. And if you have all of that, I guess you can just like, get some Kuva as well. Now, this is on a weekly rotation, so... Uh, this is what you can get from the store this week. On Monday, it's gonna rotate and there's gonna be different helmets, different aura mods, different Nightwave exclusive weapons. Uh, but you can always get Catalyst, Nightwave Extract, Vauban, and stuff like that. You have to do this. You have to do this because if you let time run out and you haven't spent your creds, they will become useless and the only thing left to do is to sell them for credits. You won't be able to use them for anything at all. <clears throat> Later. Uh, so... I might have some. Let's see. We can check- we can check my previous season. Yeah. See, intermission credits, intermission credits, Nora's choice credits. See, I didn't spend these. It's 180 credits from a previous season of Nightwave, and I just did not spend them. So, so they're useless. They're garbage. Don't let that happen to you. Because you, you can get some good stuff for this. Uh, one extra thing to keep in mind. Uh, if you haven't done all of the weeklies yet. If you do all of the weeklies in a week. Uh, the game will start reloading old Nightwave uh, quests that you or challenges that you haven't done. So you can actually still... You have four days to... Uh, to clean this up and get more Nightwave points and collect as many credits as you can so that you can spend them in the credit store. And finally, 
finally. We will have one more Nightwave rotation, which will happen on Monday. However, you will not have an entire week to clear those Nightwave challenges. You are only gonna have three days to clear them. Because on Wednesday, I'm pretty sure it is, on Wednesday, that's when this Nightwave season is going to end. Then it's gonna be like a week of nothing. And then after that, a new Nightwave season is going to begin. So, you'll get an entire new row of Nightwave quests, uh, Nightwave challenges, but you will only have three days to complete them and then spend your credits. So, be smart, be like me, and spend your credits. I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna buy some Kuva. And I got, I got 40 left. That's fine. I'll collect some more in the next coming three days, and I'm probably gonna spend the rest of it on Kuva as well, because I don't need any more Nightane Extract. Um, so yeah, you have to do that, people. <laughs> you have to do it. Do, do not miss out. Do not miss out, because if you're a new player, like, having an Oroken Catalyst in your weapon is like, oh, oh, suddenly I can actually access hard content that I couldn't do before, because now I can fit twice as many mods in my weapon. Um, yeah. So that's the PSA, people. You have four days to spend your credits, and if you don't, you are going to regret it. So, uh, thanks for your time. As always, I will see you guys again tomorrow for something completely different.